with KHO and two weather, Justin Cruz. Well, tomorrow begins the end of the heavy rain threat for the islands. Essentially, we can declare that we are done with the storm, although we will see lighter showers move through this week. It's not going to be anywhere as intense. I still do, however, have the heavy rain threat as moderate, just in case something moves into the Big Island tonight. But after tonight, this is going to be way down. Um, and southerly winds dealing with a little bit of fog right now. There's a storm. It's not as organized, kind of breaking apart, just spewing clouds of what's left of that rain. And the heaviest stuff is now moving away from the Big Island. We are still seeing a few showers for the Big Island tonight. We'll see some tomorrow and pretty much uh, through the upcoming weekend. But especially Friday, that's when we could see another uptick in showers. But do not worry, even though there'll be more rain, Friday it's not going to be the same intensity as we saw over the weekend. Dry conditions pretty much from Maui West. And we're just seeing a few light. Uh, the winds are a little bit easterly near Kauai right now. You can call those windward showers. Uh, on Oahu, the winds are just very, very light in general and somewhat southerly. Dry conditions continue for Maui and the Big Island, just seeing the last of any kind of heavy rain. And a lot of this is just high cloud cover. So we are in good shape. We can most likely declare this storm system a thing of the past. Three to four for the east and the west shores. South, we have an out of season bump. We'll see about four to six, five to seven for the north. Trades returning on Thursday. And again, another round of wet weather, although not as intense Friday in through Saturday. Plenty of sunshine Sunday. And then Monday, those winds kick up to 30 miles per hour as trade winds.